For centuries, Marines have fought for honor and for country. There is no better time than the holiday season to reflect on why we continue to work so faithfully to safeguard our great nation. The holidays bring families together and remind us of the many things we have to be thankful for. As we enter this 2012 holiday season, Bonnie and I offer our warmest greetings to each member of our Marine Corps family. Our Corps has been at war now for more than a decade. Bonnie and I are grateful for how you have bravely and dutifully shouldered the burdens of the frequent combat deployments. From our men and women on the front lines to our spouses and families holding down the fort here at home, we could not be prouder and more grateful for your dedication. To the unsung heroes of the Marine Corps, our wonderful spouses and our children, we are so thankful for everything you do to support our Marines and each other. These years of war have truly showcased how resilient and courageous you are. You have stepped up to every challenge and have made a real difference to our Corps and your local communities. As we move forward into the new year, keep doing what you're doing. Keep making a difference. You make a difference every day, and we are so very proud of you and your families. Our families are doing great things here at home while our Marines continue to perform magnificently in combat, overseas, and in garrison. Whether deployed to the fight in Afghanistan, or serving aboard ships, at American embassies, or at Marine detachments throughout the world, our Marines and sailors set the standard for professionalism and for fidelity. Thank you for the many sacrifices each of you make to ensure our freedoms. In thanking the people who make the Marine Corps as strong as it is, we cannot forget our parents of our Marines. You have entrusted our Corps with your sons and daughters, our most precious asset. We know how difficult it can be when the child you so lovingly raise cannot be home for the holidays. But we also know that you take great pride in their many selfless accomplishments, just as we do. Thank you for your invaluable support. We realize that many of our Marines are celebrating this holiday season away from home, far from their families and loved ones. You are always in our thoughts and prayers, and we hope that each of you will find a reason to celebrate this season with joy in your hearts. For those who are blessed to have their loved ones with them over the holidays, cherish each moment. So whether you are together or apart, May the spirit of Christmas touch you all. To all of our Marines, remember that this season can be difficult for many of your brothers and sisters and their families. It can be a lonely time for our deployed Marines and for the families of our fallen. This season, make the effort to reach out to Marines who are away from their loved ones, our wounded warriors, and most especially the spouses, parents, and children of the Marines we've lost. Remind them that they are never alone that we are a family that takes care of our own. Bonnie and I are honored to serve as your Commandant and First Lady of the Marine Corps. We could not be prouder of all the men and women serving in our Corps and of the families that stand so faithfully beside them. Together we can take on any challenge and accomplish any mission. We couldn't ask for a better team. May you all have a wonderful and joyous holiday season and Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, and Semper Fidelis.